Welcome back, everyone. The Ministry of Education, Youth and Information, they have um, arranged for a diagnostic test to be done very soon for the lower school, the lower primary children. Now here I have the links to the test, but for those who are worried, no, I'm not going to show the, the questions and answers. I'm just doing this quick little video to show you how to complete that first section, because I know that some people are still having difficulty. So when your teacher sends you the link to the diagnostic test, this is what the integrated studies test will look like. When you scroll down, you will see that all of this section is required. If the parent, guardian, or another responsible adult is with, is with the child, they need to ensure that the child types in all of this information correctly. So the first name needs to be typed properly. No spelling errors. Middle name, last name, same thing. Gender, make sure that you select a gender. When you're typing the email address, it should look something like this. Your child's name, birthday at moeschools.edu.jm. If you skip out anything, you put in any spaces or anything, you will have problems and the data, it just won't be good. All right, so you need to ensure that that email address is correct. For the school name, you need the entire school name. Type that in properly, class name. For example, 6A, 3B, whatever the class name is, you need to type that in. Select the parish that the school is in. And then the grade, if your child is in grade one, two, three, four, five, or six. All right, only when you have, you have correctly completed all of that, then you can continue, click next to go into, into the actual test. So that is what the integrated studies will look like. As for the language arts diagnostic test, it will look like this. You will have to fill out the same information again. This time, the test will have 60 questions. Um, each test, I don't think I mentioned that before, but each test, the child should get um, one hour and 15 minutes approximately to complete the test. So you have to fill in the first name of the child, middle name, last name of the child, gender, email address again. I'm pleading with you, please take your time and type this in correctly, just like how you got it from the school. Put the full stops in the right place. Make sure that you don't skip out anything. School name, class name, parish, and grade again. That's for the, for the language arts diagnostic test. And finally, the mathematics diagnostic test, same information again, 60 questions, three answer choices, multiple choice. You have to type in all of the information, then you can click next and go into the actual test. So that's it. Hopefully this was of use to at least one or two people. I wish you and your children the best. Hopefully all that they have learned, they'll be able to demonstrate their learning in the exam. Like, subscribe, comment, share. Have a wonderful day. See you in the next video.